This is OAT, commonly known as 10-year, and this is HOAT, commonly known as 5-year. And mixing these two coolants can be catastrophic. The coolants combined can cause a gel-like chemical reaction, essentially seizing up your cooling system. And this has become an increasingly common mistake by owners, service techs, and even the dealer. But why make a change when Chrysler's been using HOAT for years? Well, in 2013, Fiat showed up and Chrysler decided to switch to OAT. So if you know, you know, the confusion can only get worse. At the time, the coolants looked very similar in reddish orange color so to differentiate the two they decided to add a purple dye to the OAT ironically due to a weird light refraction the coolant still looks a reddish orange so here's how to make certain you use the correct coolant vehicles 2012 and older used HOAT coolant and on 2013 and newer models they used OAT so whether you are topping off or having someone service your vehicle make sure you have the right coolant we'll see you on the next one